was born to live, live to ride. Born to live, I was born to ride. American built, we forever unite. And that's the deal, I was born to ride. Now the devil to Miami, Daytona, Tallahassee, from the East Coast to the West Side, here in Florida, we were born to ride. Ride is brought to you in part by 866 Law Friend. Ride safe, ride smart. Offices in Palm Harbor. Thanks for tuning in. This week we are celebrating Born to Ride's 18th year anniversary. Yep, 18 years ago, producers Ron and Debbie Galletti launched Born to Ride Television and motorcycling history was made. To commemorate this event, a trilogy of parties were held, and the first one was at the Roadside Tavern in perfect Port Orange, Florida, with a great bike show, live music, and great food, including a genuine Florida smoked hog with all the trimmings that the Roadside Tavern served up free to all the bikers. And then we joined Dale Waxler from the Wheels Through Time Museum and check out the ultra rare 1919 Harley Davidson Model W motorcycle. So stay tuned. All this and much, much more is headed your way right now, right here, only on Born to Ride. American owned, family operated. Since 1829. No bull, just lager. From America's oldest brewery, Yingling. Born to Ride magazine, hotter than hell. And go watch Born to Ride TV. Joining us today at the Roadside Tavern is the 18th anniversary of Born to Ride TV. And uh, the bikes are showing up, Ronnie. We've got a 10 class custom bike show going on. Rocket Fly is putting the live entertainment out for us today. We have a free hog roast. That's right, free barbecue on Labor Day weekend. And uh, Budweiser will be stopping down this evening to give out free beers and free glasses to go with them. So uh, once again, Born to Ride party time over here, Ron. And uh, nice, hot, beautiful day, great food, free barbecue. Thank you very much, Yingling, America's oldest brewery, six generations. That's some good beer, Ron. And it is also Twisted Tea, the original hard iced tea, our fine sponsors down here at the Roadside Tavern today. Let me tell you what, the bikers turned out in force once again. We got Red Ember in the house. They got some stuff for us here. Got some great one of, one of a kind custom motorcycles that the people brought in. I saw a whole bunch of ladies rides today too. Trikes, Polaris's, Harley Davidson's, all kinds of stuff. It is gonna be a huge Born to Ride custom bike show today. Ron, we're fortunate enough today to have Custom Works, motorcycles and classics in the house today as our sponsor for the Born to Ride class custom bike show and they are from right here in Daytona you can find them right down on International Speedway Boulevard they have Boss Haas cycles they have Eagle Rider franchise you can buy a lightly gently used Harley Davidson from them and they also have Arctic Cat RVs and SUVs some crazy four-wheelers our friend Todd from Custom Works brought those down today and they are going to sponsor our 10 class custom bike show born to ride 
Another great year, 18 years on the TV. Don't forget, if you're over here on the east coast of Florida, it's Bright House TV, Channel 49, Friday evenings at 10, Saturday mornings at 9 a.m. And uh, this is why Born to Ride wants to be on the east coast. Roadside Tavern setting out the Born to Ride party, and you're missing it, Born to Ride. Of good things going on here, man. We got great food, food, great music. We got a lot of good bikes, a lot of good people in here. Um, got the Born to Ride. These guys are coming here and going to throw down one hell of a party for everybody, and we do appreciate it. Hey, we're uh, Custom Works. We are 833 International Speedway Boulevard in Daytona Beach, Florida. Uh, we have got. Um, all kinds of classic cars, classic bikes. Uh, we do some of the vintage bikes. We do custom bikes. Uh, we've got a full-fledged parts department, full-fledged service department. Uh, we've also uh, are an Eagle Rider dealership. So if you need to rent a bike, uh, you can come down and see us. We'll be more than happy, you know, to put together a good rental for uh, for you guys. You know, uh, on a 24-hour or a half-a-day rental. So you come down and do that and cruise Florida, uh, Florida roads, man, and have a big time with us. It, it's been. Probably one of the most fun events that we've done in a long time. We've got people from all over that are bringing in some just really nice builds. Uh, some of it's some stock stuff. Some of it's some vintage stuff. I mean, we get you know we got pan heads, shovel heads, knuckle heads. Uh, we've got any kind of you know just about any kind of bike out there that you know people are looking for, and we're just looking you know to make this bigger and better, you know, and be able to you know provide a really good service and. Do what we can for everybody. We appreciate everything that everybody has done here today. We appreciate Roadside Tavern. We appreciate Born to Ride magazine. We appreciate uh, the Rocket Fly for being a good band. Uh, and uh, you know everybody here, you know that, that's come in to see us, man. We do appreciate all them folks as well. So thank you very much. On Sunday, September the 15th, the trilogy continues. It's Born to Ride's 18th year anniversary party at High Octane Saloon in Homosassa, featuring Michael Allman live in concert. There's 500 pounds of free barbecue. Yes, 500 pounds to give back to you, the biker community, and it's served at 1 p.m. It'll all be emceed by Born to Ride's Russ Holiday. There's a flat screen TV giveaway from attorney Fran Hosh, and Born to Ride, of course, will be TV taping. There's a 10-class ride-in bike show with vendors and much more. Come on out and celebrate 18 years with Born to Ride at High Octane Saloon on Sunday, September the 15th. It's Phil Peterson's 41st Key West Poker Run from September the 19th through the 22nd. And it's winner takes all, a new Harley-Davidson 883 iron or $6,000 in cash. Sign up now online at petersonsharley.com or after September the 1st at either Peterson's location. Big Bike Riders Children's Foundation Bike Show will be held Saturday on Duval at Dirty Harry's and Rick's. It's all sponsored by Yingling to benefit Diabetes Research Institute and the Key West Rotary Club. It's the Florida Keys and Key West. Come as you are, ride responsibly, be safe, and enjoy the run. Brought to you by the Monroe County Tourist Development Council. You've been involved in a motorcycle accident. I'm the biker on your side. I'm Fran Hosh, your attorney that rides. Motorcycle accidents get my experience and personal attention. And there are no fees, no costs, unless you win. I've dedicated my career to helping accident victims and their loved ones. Your rights are my fight, and I'll never settle for less than you deserve. If you've been injured in a motorcycle accident, please call me in. 866 law or log on to lawfran.com. On Saturday, November the 2nd, it's Born to Ride's Day of the Dead Monster Jam at the England Brothers Park in Pinellas Park, Florida. It's the biggest, baddest music and motorcycle event to ever hit Florida, featuring Paul Rogers of Bad Company, Joan Jett and the Blackhearts, Molly Hatchet, Fog Hat, David Allen Coe, and from the number one rated cable TV show on the planet, Sons of Anarchy. Meet live and in person, Tig, Juice, and Katie Seagal. 
Also meet Danny the Count Coker from the History Channel TV show Counting Cars and the Black Widow Jeanette Lee, the world's best female pool player and much more. Hey vendors and sponsors or for more information call 813-531-4051 and remember this is a no colors event. Do you get our monthly exclusive newsletter? Sign up at borntoride.com and get on our mailing list today. Well, we got a, our hog roast. It's the 18th anniversary party for Born to Ride magazine here at Roadside Tavern. Uh, Kevin over here is killing the pigs. It's 150 pounds of wine. Smoke for your pleasure. Last Saturday of every month, we uh, smoke a pig. Typically have three bands on the stage, 12 hours of live music, starting at 1 in the afternoon, goes to 1 a.m. Uh, we're really happy uh, with the turnout today, Born to Ride Magazine. We've got our 10 class bike show up front, a lot of bikes, a lot of people, great turnout, great weather, good time. Roadside Tavern, 3400 South Dover Road, Born to Orange, Florida.
tell you, this is one of the best places I've been to. The parties are good, the beers are good, the beers are cold, and the ladies look pretty. Let me tell you, Roadside Tavern, come on down. <laughs> on Sunday, September the 15th, the trilogy continues. It's Born to Ride's 18th year anniversary party at High Octane Saloon in Homosassa, featuring Michael Allman live in concert. There's 500 pounds of free barbecue, yes, 500 pounds to give back to you, the biker community, and it's served at 1 p.m. It'll all be emceed by Born to Ride's Russ Holiday. There's a flat screen TV giveaway from attorney Fran Hosh, and Born to Ride, of course, will be TV taping. There's a 10 class ride in bike show with vendors and much more. Come on out and celebrate 18 years with Born to Ride at High Octane Saloon on Sunday, September the 15th. On Saturday and Sunday, September the 28th and the 29th, it's the Sarasota Freedom Fest, a motorcycle extravaganza at the Robarts Arena. It's two days of bikes, music, love, peace, and American freedom. Featuring the great Billings Band, Bobby Friss, and Southern Rock's Finest. There's a motorcycle rodeo and a Finn's Finds Dash for Cash. Born to Ride will be TV taping and holding a 10-class custom bike show. Check out the Budweiser VIP tent. There's vendors, RV hookups, and much more. See Born to Ride magazine for more information. Or call 586-909-2225. Screwy Louie's Porpoise Pub is Pinellas County's most unusual drinking establishment. And on Biker Sundays, you can join Louie's Sunday Ride. And there's a $5 breakfast buffet with drinks. And then you return to Louie's for a free buffet and a live band from 4 to 8 p.m. every Sunday. On Tuesday night, it's all-you-can-eat shrimp for only $5. And on Wing Wednesdays from 5 to close, it's all-you-can-eat wings for only $9.99. Remember, there's live music every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. For a full lineup, check out Born to Ride magazine. All this and so much more is going on at the world-famous Screwy Louie's Porpoise Pub in Seminole. Do you get our monthly exclusive newsletter? Sign up at borntoride.com and get on our mailing list today. Hey, Dale here from the Wales Through Time Museum. I'm going to talk about an extremely obscure bike in Harley Davidson's 100 plus year history, and that's called the Model W, invented by W.S. Harley in 1919. They made the bike for three years 1919, 1920, 21. Uh, a lot of exports of this machine, very few are actually ever seen in this country and probably not many seen overseas. You know, W.S. Harley was actually, William S. Harley was actually responsible for many of the patents from the Harley Motor Company all the way through the years, including the 36 knucklehead. But in 1919, Harley Davidson, struggling for new markets around the world, developed the opposed twin cylinder machine, hopefully trying to find the favor of women riders and young riders built and developed this extremely unique and really extremely cool motorcycle to really diminishing sales uh, by 1920 and 21. Only a handful of W models exist today. This machine is so incredibly original and it runs so well. I get it out regularly here at Wheels Your Time, take it for a spin. Our visitors love this thing. You know, the design of this machine really is so far separate from Harley-Davidson's traditional V-twin engine flat opposed motor, transmission actually sits above the engine, kickstart arrangement. I also think it's the only Harley Davidson you can kickstart in gear. In other words, the combination of clutch and engine is quite separate than anything Harley ever designed. Lightweight, three-speed transmission, very easy to handle, actually surprisingly snappy at speeds up to 45 or 50 miles an hour. You know, if Harley was going for simple construction, this is not the unit. The very unusual engine, lots of parts on this bike. It's actually one of the only Harleys with a in-the-frame fuel tank and quite a unique fork as well. Single band rear brake chain drive, capable of speeds 35 to 45 miles an hour, actually quite smooth. It amazes a lot of people. You know, two things that really stand out about this motorcycle, one being the way it runs so extremely perfect, and secondly, the condition of this motorcycle. These fenders have never had a wrinkle. Although it shows a little wear here and there, the nickel plating, the condition of the sheet metal, original footboards, original hand grips, you just don't see bikes like this today.
You know, this old Harley sure is no dog, and it runs great. I thoroughly enjoy its low speed maneuverability, 40, 45 miles an hour down the highway. Great for really any vintage meet. People always wonder, what is a W Harley? And now you know, right here in the time machine. Don't miss Bike Nights, every night featured in the new Born to Ride magazine. A complete listing of Born to Ride's hottest bike nights for you to check out. This month's issue features the Sarasota Freedom Fest motorcycle extravaganza on the front cover. And make sure you check out Born to Ride's Page 3 Girl in every issue of Born to Ride magazine. Pick up your free copy today. When do you crave refreshing iced tea? Twisted Tea wants to know. The next time you want that same satisfying refreshment, but with a kick, grab a Twisted Tea. Twisted Tea, the refreshing hard iced tea that tastes like real iced tea with a kick. I've been representing accident victims for nearly a decade, and I've always wanted an office where my clients would feel comfortable and welcome. I'm attorney Fran Hosh, and I've also always been a fighter never backing down to any insurance company or their attorneys when it comes to representing my client's rights. Let me deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. If you've been injured in an accident, please call me at 866-LAW-FRAN or log on to lawfran.com. Born to Ride is a multimedia marketing and promotional machine with TV, magazines, streaming radio, and internet advertising opportunities. There are tens of thousands of motorcycles. We reach the people who ride them. Born to Ride. Find out more at borntoride.com. Hi, this is Joe Brooks, General Manager at Quail Hollow Country Club. I want to let everybody know what a pleasure it is to work with Ron Galetti over at Born to Ride Magazine. Ron has done four biker bashes with us and they've grown on each event. We're expecting about 3,000 bikes for the next event. And Ron brings a variety of vendors to us, uh, great partnerships, relationships. The guy knows everybody in town, uh, has a great crowd. And working with Ron, his photographers, uh, his family is always a pleasure. They're very professional. They're always available for any uh, questions or uh, curveballs that we get during the event. And I tell you, Ron Galetti and his family are the hardest working people in the advertising business. They're always there for you, whatever you need. And it's always a pleasure to work with Ron. Hey, Jerry Motorman Paladino here for Born to Ride TV with my tip of the week. The vast majority of motorcycle crashes occur at low speeds. In order to avoid that, you have to become proficient at handling your motorcycle at low speeds. Now, I know a lot of you would like to practice, but you might be afraid of dropping your bike and damaging it or even getting hurt. One of the things you could do if your bike is equipped with highway pegs is turn them upside down. In other words, normally this peg would tilt up, but I've turned it upside down. So now if the bike tips over, it's going to land right on that peg. Won't go any further and you won't damage your paint or your tank or your windshield. Works like a charm. It's just one bolt to flip that upside down whenever you're practicing. If you want to be a better rider, you got to practice, but you have to know what to practice. For more tips, tricks, and techniques, log on to www.ridelikeapro.com. See you next week. On Sunday, September the 15th, the trilogy continues. It's Born to Ride's 18th year anniversary party at High Octane Saloon in Homosassa, featuring Michael Allman live in concert. There's 500 pounds of free barbecue, yes, 500 pounds to give back to you, the biker community, and it's served at 1 p.m. It'll all be emceed by Born to Ride's Russ Holiday. There's a flat screen TV giveaway from attorney Fran Hosh, and Born to Ride, of course, will be TV taping. There's a 10-class ride-in bike show with vendors and much more. Come on out and celebrate 18 years with Born to Ride at High Octane Saloon on Sunday, September the 15th. On Saturday, November the 2nd, it's Born to Ride's Day of the Dead Monster Jam at the England Brothers Park in Pinellas Park, Florida. It's the biggest, baddest music and motorcycle event to ever hit Florida, featuring Paul Rogers of Bad Company, Joan Jett and the Blackhearts, Molly Hatchet, Fog Hat, David Allen Coe, and from the number one rated cable TV show on the planet, 
Sons of Anarchy. Meet live and in person Tig, Juice, and Katie Seagal. Also meet Danny the Count Coker from the History Channel TV show Counting Cars and the Black Widow, Jeanette Lee, the world's best female pool player, and much more. Hey, vendors and sponsors, or for more information, call 813-531-4051. And remember, this is a No Colors event. For all those people that are all smartened up talking kids, Arnie and Kay Fizz, eh? and they know what's going on. What you gonna do when Borden and Ride runs wild on you, brother? Salavida, amigos, and amigos. 